Hey, what's up everyone? Koban around here 456 here today, going to be continuing my playthrough on the mods for Sonic Generations PC. So it has been quite a while since I've actually done some of these, but we're finally back at it, and uh you know, today I'm going to be doing a character mod from Ultimate Darkman 2010. So I want to give a big thanks to him as I requested this character mod, and uh, he was very, very kind enough and generous enough to um, complete it and uh, give me a download link. So we're going to be testing out um, not a real character, but a fan-made character, and that is Hyper Shaddock. So in case you all don't know who this character is. Basically, this is a character that kind of like hails from a fanfic, but was actually very well received, and that's called Not So Unleashed. You can look it up on YouTube. I believe it was, I believe it was uh, created from a guy named uh, Chakra X from Newgrounds. But basically, it was a fanfic that was made about uh, quite a few years ago, where basically there was this character called Not So, and uh, you know he was like the ultimate like villain. And uh, Sonic and Shadow kind of basically had to fuse together and take them out. So, um, what I'm going to do actually is go against the boss in, uh, let's see, the boss in City Escape right here. And as you can see, there is Natsu in his perfect form, Natsu Unleashed. So, I don't really, like, I've watched the New Grounds, you know, like, I've watched the whole Natsu Unleashed movie and stuff like that. In fact, I believe it was actually re-uploaded in HD recently. But, uh, you know, for all the people who uh, have seen it, let me know in the comments below if you have. And, uh, you know, tell me your opinions on what you think about it. Because normally, I don't really like fanfics or too many fan-made characters, but, you know, this these characters I always did love. Here we go, let's go! Yeah! Look at that, that's sick. Alright. So we're gonna take down not so basically hyper shadow controls just like you know regular sonic this is just a texture hack so you know if you turn supersonic basically you're just gonna turn into supersonic which kind of defeats the purpose of playing as hyper shadow but as you can see right here okay we're gonna have to start drifting right here in order to make sure he doesn't pass us up right here but yeah, like I said, you know, I'm, I've never been terribly too fun to fanfics in the past, but, you know, I think it was because I watched, you know, this, like, you know, little series that was created. Um, I watched it when I was younger, around, like, maybe 12, 11 years old, so, you know, I always did like it because, you know, I was kind of a bit more, you know, open to stuff like that back then, and uh, I think it's actually a really cool story anyway. Anyway, just keep on drifting right here so that this dude doesn't get it. There we go. We got ourselves. Here we go. Hyper Shadow power up. Woo! Let's go. Scroosh! Alright, so basically, this is exactly the same boss fight, but, you know, I just think it's really fun to play because it's just like we get to see, you know, Hyper Shadow, you know, he has different animations and all that stuff, so just keep on getting them. Oh no! Hyper Shaddock is running low on rings! What shall we do? Oh, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna take this dude from behind! Let's go! And there we go. <laughs> He's tripping balls. Oh my god! Look at that! <laughs> Jeez! <laughs> he had so many rings inside of him. But there we go. We have defeated Perfect Not So. Whoa! <laughs> I have never had that happen right there. Jeez, okay. So there we go, defeat the boss right there in 1 minute and 27 seconds. Not my fastest time, but very close. And we got ourselves an S rank. So, uh, one other thing, I guess I'll kind of give a few little fun facts about Perfect Not So. Funny thing is that in the uh, kind of like fanfic, Perfect Not So actually, I'm sorry, not Perfect Not So, Perfect or Hyper Shaddock actually consumed around 50 to 60 rings in a second. But the thing is, is that he actually had the ability to um, basically gather rings. He was like a magnet, and he could gather rings all over the world and basically have them come to him so that he could pretty much never run out of power because, like I said, he does consume power very quickly. So I think I'll just do one more stage just for the heck of it because, uh, you know, I don't want this video to be too short. But I think I'm going to go to... what's... oh, actually, perfect. 
we're gonna go to the Sky Sanctuary because they actually fought on Angel Island when, uh, you know, during the whole, like, fight. Alright, quick edit right there, sorry about that. Had to, um, turn the skills on, but anyway. Skadoosh! One thing I like though is that little life counter up top. It kind of like shows, uh, what is it? Like a little hyper shattic little image right there. It's kind of cool. Anyway. Whoa! Holy crap! Okay. So apparently he has uh, an enhanced air boost right here, like, uh, I believe Silver and Blaze. I did not realize that actually. But anyway, yeah, I'm so far, I'm really actually digging this texture mod. It's actually really nice. And, uh, also like the little, like, rainbow kind of, I don't even know, like, it looks almost like, I don't know what to explain. It almost looks almost like a comet, like his boost. It looks like something that's, like, you know, just gonna blow up, like, do a huge amount of damage. I don't know. Like, it has a rainbowish look to it, but it also looks, oh god, no, whoa. I forgot about his extended boost. <laughs> that almost got me right there. Alright, here we go. There we go. That's more like it. What the heck? Get back up there. Alright. Get on that orb right there. But yeah, if you all have any uh, opinions, like I said, on the uh, whole, like, you know, like, Nazo Unleashed story, let me know in the comments below. In fact, I believe there is actually a new, like, continuation of the story actually released. I don't know when exactly it was and or how good it was, because I actually did not watch it at all. But, uh, I believe it was actually released. So, if any of y'all have seen that, you know, love to hear your opinions. Oh god, holy crap, here we go. Also, another thing, he kind of like has the unleashed drift. But anyway, there we go, goal. And not my fastest time, like I said. It's been a while since I've actually played this game, but still managed to achieve an S rank right there. All right, so I guess that basically does it for this video. So thank you all so much for watching. Please remember to comment, like, and subscribe. Stay tuned for more vids, walkthroughs, and updates. Hope you all enjoyed the video, and if you did, like I said, make sure to drop a like and a comment, it helps out a ton, and I will make sure to upload more character mods if more people, you know, want me to keep on uploading uh, character mods of this game. Also though, make sure to go check out Ultimate Darkman 2010's channel, I will have his link in the description below, and want to give him a big thanks for actually, you know, doing this mod for me, and uh, you know, if you all want to download it, you can just download it on his channel in the description below. But anyway, that does it, so thanks again. See you all, have a good day.